Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to set up a free domain and a free website. Now to begin, you want to open an internet browser session. Maybe it be Internet Explorer, Mozilla, Chrome, Safari, I don't mind. Now what you need to do is go on Weebly.com. Now this program is for Macs, a Leopard, or anything, Linux, and Windows 7, Vista, anything, yeah. Now I'm going to type in the details that they ask me to and I'm going to press sign up it's free now I'm going to verify my uh, um, sign up and I'm gonna begin now you're gonna enter a title for your website uh, I'm just gonna enter something like um, my website now the type of site it is, it's going to be personal. Make sure it's personal or you can make it whatever you think it is. I'm going to make it as personal. I'm going to continue and I'm going to use the subdomain. Don't use the register a new domain or the domain you already know because it's going to cause problems. Now I'm going to type then Enscriptor Tutorial Web. Now I'm going to continue. It's going to load the interface, of course, and now, as you can see, my website, and you can change the text at any time. And to change the design, if you don't like it, you can change it here. And my preferred one, I don't think it. this is, but this looks nice, so I'm going to continue with this. Now, this is for phone numbers or anything you want to add, such as text. Now, I am going to go to Pages, and I'm going to edit the home page and if you don't want to have the banner you can also select this or this which is this is preferred if you think it is so as you can see it's empty now but just to stay classy I'm gonna add a bit of the banner and I'm going to drag my first text so a paragraph with the title my first paragraph my first sentence now this should be it and to add new pages that go here and add a page and then it should appear here right here uh, depending on your design now if I, I can change designs at any time for example like this but I prefer to save the last one you can also see this now uh, you can add your Facebook so I'm gonna add um, inscriptor it's Facebook facebook.com slash mr. inscriptor and twitter.com slash mr. inscriptor now you can uncheck these if you don't want to then you can add a quote or something inscriptor www.inscriptor.co.tc now without wasting any time what you should do now is publish your website continue just use the subdomain and then navigate to your website. So, inscriptor uh, tutorial web dot weebly dot com. My first paragraph, my first sentence, and they yeah they won't see much, but yeah this is it. Now what you need to do it now. Well, I just make sure you have the www here uh, and HTTP. Save that publish now we're gonna go into the code.cc website you get free domains at the absolutely no cost unless you want a few domains for business and of course now some domains won't be free just so you know now I'm gonna register a domain first I'm gonna register or choose a domain I'm gonna choose inscriptor web tut I'm going to check the availability. Now it's available and it's for no cost. I'm going to continue to registration. And what you want to do is create an account. Just follow, do it. So my name is Daniel and then machine. Birth date. I'm just going to put something random. June. And then I'm going to put some date I'm gonna put something close though so somewhere around here the email address inscriptor01 at gmail.com a password the verification code or captcha 
and continue. Now I believe it's going to ask you to verify your email and we're just going to do that. Now I'm doing this everything with you so you won't get confused. The verification uh, word is wrong. I'm just going to choose something that I can see. Eatly. Let's. Something like this. Or retype password. Uh, yeah, so it should be something like this. And I'm going to rage if it's not right again. Now, I think you just go to inscriptor01 at gmail.com. That's my email. Type in the password, the verification code. Jed C N K home. Gonna sign in and then we received the request. I'm gonna set the domain up. In order to set this, I'm just gonna go and click set up. And what you're gonna do is gonna URL forward it, so choose number three for code.cc and then you're gonna redirect it to your website. So inscriptor web no tutor inscriptor tutorial web. I believe it is. Let's see if it is. Inscriptor tutorial yep. It is so now you're gonna forward it dot weebly dot com make sure it's under dot weebly dot com do not include HTTP as it's already included for you and what you want to do is you're going to add descriptions for it for example this is a tutorial web created by Daniel Machan from Mr. Inscriptor now keyword something that every search engine has meta uh, meta keywords so they're gonna ask you something certain that you wanna yeah so what you wanna do is under frame go to URL hiding and stuff and now for the keyboards what you wanna do is type something common that people will search now you're gonna set up page title sorry and scripter tutorial website and the change has been submitted so now if we use it uh, cc it should redirect us as you can see and you will always have this fav icon unless you upgrade thank you for watching leave anything that you want in the description I mean in the comments likes dislikes please I want to know your feedback if you enjoyed this or not thank you very much that was another tutorial by Daniel Machan from Mr. Inscription